Hello and welcome back to Bits and Bobs. Today's video is all about the 1919 sixpence in the reign of King George V. The coin we can see on screen now. I will first go through the design of the coin and then move on to the facts and figures. So here we have the reverse design featuring a crowned Lion of England facing out of the coin and stood atop a crown, a lovely larger and more ornate and detailed royal crown there. To the side of this is the two numbers 19 each side for of course the date of issue 1919. We then have a border around this. To the bottom is the word sixpence, of course giving us the value or denomination. And then to the top there is part of the legend in abbreviated Latin, which reads Fid Death Ind Im, or in English meaning Defender of the Faith, Emperor of India. Of course, relating to King George V, who holds those titles. Moving over to the obverse, we can see King George V there. This is his only portrait for coins, and it was done by Bertram McKennell, whose initials BM can be seen below the king's bust there. Now the king faces to the left, with no crown or no laurel. Around him is the legend of the coin, which reads Georgivus V de Gra Brit Om Rex. And once again, this is an abbreviated Latin, and translated to English as George V, by the grace of God, King of all the Britons. The rest of the titles he holds as king, and how they believed that he was chosen to be king by God. Around the rim we can see small teeth milling or beading. This prevents the coin's edges from being clipped or shaven. So there's the design, and now on to the facts and figures. So this is a coin minted at the Tower Hill Mint in London, where the Royal Mint was based between 1810 and 1975. The coin is composed of 0.925 silver, so this is 92.5% pure silver, or known as sterling silver, and was the final year of sterling silver in coins, after it went 50% the year after. The weight is 2.83 grams, as was set by George III in the Great Recoinage, and again, unchanged as the Great Recoinage, the diameter of a sixpence is 19 millimeters. So a fairly small coin. The mintage for this year of sixpence is 13,375,447. So a very common coin with well over 10 million produced that year. The sixpence piece is of course worth sixpence. This is one half of a shilling, or one fortieth of a pound sterling. So there would be 40 of these to the pound. And back in 1919, a sixpence was equal to one pound 62 today. So some good buying power the sixpence had back then, and you could definitely buy some stuff with a sixpence in 1919. And the coin was demonetized in 1980 after serving as a two and a half pence piece for a while after decimalization. Now then onto the value for a collector today. It'll sell for around three pounds in poor condition around six pounds in fine condition, about 20 pounds in extremely fine condition, and then up to 45 pounds in uncirculated grade. So though some higher prices are there for the higher grades, overall, a not too unaffordable coin for most collectors to add to their collection in whatever their preferred grade is for their budget. So there we go. Comment down below, do you have this coin? And of course as well, please subscribe if you've enjoyed. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you again soon for some more coins in the future on Bits and Bobs. Bye for now.